Okay, um, for this problem, what we need to do is we need to evaluate for the cosine of 75 degrees. We're going to evaluate using the half angle format. So the, um, the half angle format says cosine u divided by 2 equals plus or minus the square root of 1 plus cosine of u all divided by, or divided by 2. So if I know that the cosine of 75 degrees is u over 2, I need to figure out what u equals. So to do that, I'm going to multiply by 2 on both sides and get 150 degrees equals u. So now what I can do is I can plug that in for so cosine of 75 degrees equals plus or minus radical 1 plus cosine of 150 degrees all over 2. Now I need to determine what is the cosine of 150 degrees. So I go ahead and take a look at my unit circle. I determine 150 degrees is going to be roughly here and I think about my unit circle that's going to be the point radical negative 3 over 2 comma 1 half. So therefore, this equals plus or minus radical 1 minus radical 3 over 2 all divided by 2. Now, what we need to do to simplify this is I can think about this and think, you know, I want to get rid of this fraction. We don't like having fractions, right? I hate fractions. Stop it with the fractions, right? No, not really. <laughs> So what we're going to do to get rid of the fractions is just multiply by your denominator. So I see my denominator here is 2, so I'm going to multiply the top and the bottom to keep my fraction equivalent. So I've got to multiply everything by 2. So when I do that, I get plus or minus radical 2 minus radical 3 all over 4. Now what I can do is I can extract the square root of the denominator 4 and I can get my final answer is plus or minus one half, because the square root of four is two, but it's still in the denominator, times two minus radical three. And there you go. That's how you find the cosine uh, or the half angle of your cosine of 75 degrees.